Okay guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Now today we are going to be talking all about ARK's big December update, which will be coming in a few weeks time. This is always one of my favorite times of the year for ARK because you know, Christmas is here. It's always lots of updates and it's gonna be even bigger this year because there is so much content coming, especially the Scorched Earth Ascension. I hope you guys do enjoy today's video. As always, if you do, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you're new to the channel as it supports me so much and let's get in with today's video. Now, what I actually want to start with is how this is going to be the final event of Ark Survival Evolved 1. Now, I know a lot of people get very frustrated when I say that, but that's why I actually brought up the information just for some of you guys to see this. I know it is painful um, because, you know, Ark 1, we've had like seven years of events now, guys. And to think that this is actually the final one of the whole thing. Like right now, we have Turkey Trial, um, but uh, Winter Wonderland will be the last one and i'm just going to show you guys that information here so you can see it it comes back in a community crunch talking about a, a, um, event cosmetics and wildcard went on to say we know you folks uh, enjoy your event cosmetics so as we enter into our last year of arc uh, of events on arc one we'll be uh, adding all the associated cosmetics to the hexagon exchange once uh, once each event ends Speaking of, we've added the Love Evolve cosmetics to the Hexagon store this week. So as you can see, this was back in like February when the uh, Love Evolved event end. And all the event content will be added to the PC game at the um, end of the year's cycle of events. So they could be opted into our PC unofficial server owners and players. Our console players will be able to grab all events cosmetics from the Hex store. So there you go. As it is seen there, guys, we know you folks enjoy your event cosmetics. So as we enter into our last year of arc uh, of events on arc one so it's it is sad don't get me wrong because i mean i've been covering this guys for seven years i i, I mentioned that i've been making arc videos since i was 16 and i'm now 23 and this game has been the massive part of my life like i can't even explain how big and you know to think over all this time that these because you know it's the end of the events for the first game it's a big thing but you know at the end of the day it won't be the end of events forever the events will return with arc 2 so don't worry about that now another tweet that came just before this as well was when cedric didn't know if it was 100 percent yet um but this person said this was back in march last event will be christmas according to said who hasn't commented yet on those who asked about the screenshot and cedric replied saying that's as much as we know at the moment winter wonderland will likely be it i will update when i get more info and that's when they went in to obviously you know give us all the information that this is the last year of events on arc one but before we all get sad about it and everything like that let's enjoy it in the moment so far it's turkey trial for another week guys so we've got you know that's a week and a half we've got that event and then we move on to the big december update which is what we're talking about today which will be winter wonderland seven so this has actually been one of the event that i think is the longest running event to be honest because a lot of the other ones only actually made it to six because there was delays when some events weren't coming at certain years but the christmas updates you always kind of kept its uh, place in the game and uh, last year this update went live on december 14th and it lasted it until january the 6th now something i did want to mention is that it has been confirmed that all the other content we're going to be talking about today is coming exactly the same time as the Christmas update. So it's all going to be in one patch. So you won't have separate patches for it. So in like two weeks time is when your mo two and a half weeks time is when you'll be seeing this. So obviously Arc Winter 1 to Land 7 is an Arc Survival Evolved Winter event. Um, and during the event, Raptor Claws flies between midnight and two o'clock in the morning in game time, obviously, <laughs> in a straight line across all maps, dropping presents containing mistletoe, coal and various resources, loot blueprint for high quality equipment. On the aberration map, they only fly across the... Um, well, so, like, so obviously certain services, just because obviously a lot of it's underground. Um, so if that's what you're going to have on Aberration, if, if that's what you're playing at the moment, 
Gacha Claws roams around the maps in winter wonderland. When fed coal or mistletoe, they produce gacha crystals containing high quality equipment, armor and weapons, and winter wonderland event items. See below of how to feed the gacha claws, which you know you just put it in its inventory, and you can put up to five coal in to get better slash rarer items. It will then drop a special gacha crystal containing your gift. For mistletoe, only one is required and more than one will not get you better results. Um, and the uh, harvesting was times three last year, taming, breeding as all of that. 0 0.5 mating interval and 1.5 hexagon bonus will most likely be the same this year. The colors will most likely get new colors, but so far we've got jade, pine green, spruce green, dark magenta, glacial, powder blue, teal, dark violet, red, Green, light grey, light red, dark red, dino light red, dino light green, di dino medium green, dino albino, uh, albino near white and yellow. Obviously, the creatures for this event are the gatch is gatch claws and raptor claws. We have items of coal, holiday light, holiday tree, snowman, gift box, holiday stocking, and mistletoe. Um, we have lots of different skins. The Parasaur Arc animated series costume actually came. I don't know whether they'll add in, add in any more animated series stuff this year. I actually think it'll be complete, completely the same, um, just because that everything's Arc 2 now. You will be seeing the return of the Santa costume skin um there was a trailer for this one oh no there wasn't it was in winter wonderland 5 was what the trailer was um so it'll be the return of the santa costume skin lots of um ugly noglin sweater skins and rockwell and raptor claw sweater skins as well and different beanies for you guys to get um be the return of the nutcracker uh, cracker slingshot skin um uh the candy cane and christmas bowler skin uh, obviously more ugly sweaters. The Santa hat skin's been in the game right from the beginning um, and all of that stuff will be coming. The return of the Santa emote, the caroling uh, emote, the happy clap emote and the nutcracker dance emote will be coming. And then we'll have some new chibis, which last year was the Amargosaurus when Lost Island came out, the animated series Raptor, the Dinopithecus, the festive Noglin and the Cynomacrops from Lost Island as well. So when I say this is the last event, there actually will be a kind of half event as well uh, towards the end, which is the Happy New Year event. I'll be making a video closer to the time for you guys to have all the information you need to know about the Happy New Year event. So that will be Winter Wonderland 7. This one was 6, but it'll be 7 coming in a couple of weeks time. But not only are we getting that within the update, we will be getting PC, Xbox, and PlayStation will be getting all the new expanded story content being added to the Switch, well, which has already been added to the Switch. The new story uh, cinematics, the Scorch of Ascension, updated Rockwell boss, voiced Helena and Rockwell Explorer notes and dossiers, other goodies, and it will debut on other platforms December 2022's holiday update, which is what we're talking about today. So all of this and Winter Wonderland will be coming to the game in literally like two weeks to two and a half weeks time. So prepare yourself for a very large patch. Um, I'm going to be saying about I'm going to say about 20 gigabytes to 30. I'm scared it's going to be massive for console out of nowhere, um, but we never know. We'll see what happens there. But that is that update. And now what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to take ourselves back like we've been doing in every single final event update type thing is we go and rate our favorite events from the beginning of the game as this is the last Christmas event on Arc 1. So Winter Wonderland 6 was okay. Okay, well, when I say okay, it was very good, but um, you know, but it, it, we're going to be voting throughout the years, you know, so it's a very, very tough thing because there's all there was delays between certain events. I think it was number one and two because there, uh, if you guys remember, events actually stopped for a certain amount of time in Arc. I think the event stopped. Um, uh, it was 2016. The events were well, the last event was, and then there wasn't another one until 2018. Um, number one was fantastic. Uh, it started. Um, it started uh, just at the end of December, um, and this is just when uh, Xbox got game preview as well. Um, so, and it ended uh, January fifth, twenty sixteen. You could see how the events come a long way from the beginning of the events because back in Winter Wonderland uh, one, uh, we got like you know the 
the Santa hat skin, the reindeer costume, the cane, uh, candy cane club skin, and then gift boxes and stuff. And so it was very, very, very tiny compared. Raptor Claws has been around right since the beginning. It was Gacha Claws that was added later in. This was an amazing event as it was the first one. Second one wasn't really that special. It was pretty much the same. There was a snowball emote added in, so that needs some uh, recognition there because that is one of the most fun emotes in the game. Then three deserves big, big recognition recognition because this was the first um uh, edition of gacha claws to join wrapped claws in the game um which was in uh, december 18 2018 um lots of different stuff added in here and really really cool uh, uh so events so i think that's going to be up there then four came along and uh you know it was i feel like this one was another massive upgrade from the year before did we not we didn't have the colors did we no we didn't in winter wonderland 3 we didn't have the colors so this was the first year of the colors uh winter wonderland 4 which again lots of new stuff added in 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 here so i feel like 4 could be up there with one of the best ones and then 5 was the was it the beginning of the santa no it wasn't six was the beginning of the santa the, the santa skin wasn't it yeah the santa costume skin and anything with the, the costume skins i thought was one of the biggest upgrades because they were so cool to see them in game so the voting the way we're going to go here is we're going to give the number one spot of the best winter wonderland event two mm, out of memory i'm going to give it to winter wonderland three takes the number one spot just because of the fact that it was such a big change from the beginning and then gacha claws and raptor claws were added in so it was like a real good like move into 2019 uh you know i feel like this is was such a good time in life and uh, just in general so i think this takes number one spot and then at number two i'm gonna give it to winter wonderland six because uh last year's event i thought was just so so good it had everything we wanted within a christmas event in arc and they added in a bunch of new colors loads of new stuff and the santa costume skin so i just thought last year was years was great then at number three at the third spot we're going to give it to the first ever winter wonderland just because i thought it was a great event and uh you know it was the first ever one to come to arc and you know nothing had been seen like that before so we're going to be giving it to the, that and then we'll give for the fourth spot uh fourth spot sorry and fifth spot to number two so our ratings is Winter Wonderland 3 at number 1, Winter Wonderland 6 at number 2, Winter Wonderland 1 at number 3 at the th Now why do I keep getting that wrong at third spot? Winter Wonderland 4 in the fourth spot and then finally uh in the final spot we are giving it to Winter Wonderland 2. So that's our rating. You guys can let me know your ratings for your favorite Winter Wonderland event over the years if you've been playing it. Arcs December update will be coming in the next two and about two and a half weeks. Winter Wonderland and big content. Watch out for it. Thank you for watching, guys. Leave a like and subscribe. And I hope you enjoy the final final event. Apart from the ha apart from the tiny Happy New Year event, of course, which only lasts for twenty four hours. But hope you enjoy it, guys. Keep enjoying Turkey Trial. Leave a like, subscribe. And I'll catch you in my next video very soon.